In this video, I'm gonna review the step ladder that I use from Gorilla Ladders. Now, this is probably one of the, the most frequently asked about items on the YouTube channel, funny enough. It's a step ladder. I use it in almost every detail that I go to. I use it for various reasons, and it comes in handy, and it's probably one of the best tools, I guess you can call it, that I use to help me out. So here is the step ladder, the platform, whatever you wanna call it. You fold it out. You lock it in place and now it's nice and sturdy and it's not gonna fall on you I'm actually not sure on how much this specific ladder was I believe it was around $40 that US $40 US and I got it at a local uh, my local Home Depot and I'm pretty sure they sell them at Lowe's too so I bought these locally they do have a website and you can buy them I think online but you can find these locally there's different types but the great thing is about this is if you're doing like let's say uh, some interior cleaning uh, you can use this as a platform to work on so instead of getting on your knees and working on the ground to clean the carpets or whatever it is you're gonna be cleaning you can put the mats on the actual platform here and you don't have to bend over all the way to the ground you can just work off of here which really helps you can also just set your items here your products your tools because uh, again, bending over all the way to the ground, it doesn't seem like a big deal, but doing it for three, four hours when you're reaching over, bending down, does kind of take its toll during the detail. So if you have your chemicals, products, uh, towels on here while you're working, uh, instead of having to, having to bend over all the time, uh, that really works out. And I kind of use the, the, the platform, this bench here, as like my headquarters during the detail. So if I'm gonna bring something out, if I'm gonna eventually use something, if I'm putting something back, it will be on this bench or around this bench so I have a designated area of where to go and get everything. And lastly, as you can imagine, if you're not that tall, I'm 5'5", five five, so I do need a lot of help with bigger cars, is obviously you just stand on this. It's super sturdy. It's not gonna go off on you. Uh, it's you know made out of metal, so it's definitely gonna hold you up. Um, you know you don't want to do anything stupid with it, but it will definitely save you time. And because it's not like a ladder where once you go up, you have you know this much space to place your feet. You can actually walk around on this, so you can get you know you can get through with the um, the top of the roof. You can get a good size of it done by without even moving this because obviously it's such a long platform. You can walk around and work the areas that you need to work. Now, one thing to note is that there is a lot of metal on this, so you have to be very careful to not to make sure you don't bump it into paint or hit wheels or something like that because you will obviously scuff it and possibly damage it with uh, putting a deep scratch because it is all metal. Now what you can do is buy some foam and heat adhesive and glue one side and always have that foam side facing the vehicle that way there is no potential risk or at least you're greatly minimizing and reducing the chances of you hitting the vehicle um, as you can tell I don't have that on mine just because I'm fairly used to it and I don't really use it that much around the cars um, so it's not a really big deal to me but if that's something that you're worried about by all means I highly re recommend you get some type of foam pad and tape it to one side and always have that one side facing the vehicle and I say this is probably one of the best tools I've bought because that whole bending over uh, actually does not waste a lot of time, but it's just like a mundane task you have to do when, when, you're, when you're getting out of the car or when you're working on the exterior of it and instead you have to bend all the way down and then all the way up. It, it sounds very mundane and like it doesn't sound like something essential. At least it may not be to you, but to me it is. But instead of just having it on this platform to not have to bend all the way over is super helpful and I absolutely love it because of that. So this was a very short video. Again, this is by far one of the most frequently asked for products that I get on this channel is where did you get that platform? How much was it? Where did you get it from? So very interesting. It's just a platform. It's your local uh, you know, Home Depot, Lowe's, if you're in the United States. Um, check online. But yeah, this was like about 40 bucks, so it wasn't that much of a deal breaker. This is my second one now, the first one. Um, I lent it to someone, never got it back. So anyways, that's that. Hope you enjoyed this video. Leave your comment down below if you have something equivalent to this or maybe an alternative to this because you can also buy like a regular uh, two, three step ladder, but I feel like this gives you a much more, um, gives you much more useful usefulness on the detail instead of just having that little ladder with a little small platform to place your feet on. This is kind of safer. Obviously it's not gonna get you as high if you need to, like if this is like an RV or like a lifted truck or anything. Again, depending on how tall you are. I'm not the tall, so I would need an actual ladder for a lifted truck. But other than that, this is a great tool item, whatever you want to call it. Leave your comment down below if you have any, any other suggestions equivalent to this. Like this video, subscribe, and I'll see you on the next video.